So from the Bronx, from New York, I live in LA now, and I, uh, I miss New York though, man, I miss New York. I miss all the dumb comments you hear just walking down the street. I was here one time when the US soccer team lost the World Cup to a small country in Africa called Ghana. I swear, I literally heard these two New Yorkers talking, they were like, could you believe we lost to a bunch of freaking Ghanaians? <laughs> And I was like, I can't believe you actually think that's what they call themselves. <laughs> but it's that New York accent that makes everything sound all the more ridiculous. It's the exact opposite of the English accent, where everything sounds correct, right? But see, that's the problem. In America, we mistake accent with intellect. We think they're all smart, because no matter what they're talking about, <laughs> they sound quite intelligent, right? It doesn't matter. They can talk about anything. It'd be like, my balls are quite itchy. <laughs> and we'd be like, that dude is smart, okay? <laughs> but they're not all smart. They just sound smart. They look dumb with the crooked teeth and the wacky hair. Oh yeah, you go to England, some of those Englishmen have that elephant man look about them, like, I know I look a bit frightening, but <laughs> at least I sound intelligent, right? <laughs> the, English, the English have a weird thing with the letter T. You know what I'm saying? A weird thing with that, because sometimes they overpronunciate the letter like that. <laughs> and sometimes they ignore the letter completely. <laughs> it's like, what happened? Where did the letters go? And there are two T's in the word letter, and yet they're nowhere to be found. <laughs> it's quite odd, right? No, you know, I... I understand, I understand if there's like one T, you just missed it, you know, that's fine, whatever, whatever, one T gone, fine. <laughs> but when there are two T's, you just skip over it like that, it's just rude. It's like the letters don't even matter. <laughs> the English and their T's, they spend half their days drinking T's and the other half ignoring them. 